today i'll be going over all the important shortcuts to really help your production speed up to 10x we're going to start with the basic ones then gradually move up first of all we have our number one savior ctrl z which is to undo ctrl a to create a new node ctrl shift a to instance a scene ctrl f1 to go to the 2d scene ctrl f2 to go to the 3d scene ctrl f3 to go to the script editor and you get the point ctrl f to find in the script editor ctrl r to replace ctrl shift f to find the files and you can literally type anything and it's going to go through all the scripts you have in the whole project f1 for help and it's really useful if you want to research about a new node or a new function or a new property next up we have the tool section which is also a very important part of godot so the first one we have is q for the select tool w for the move tool e for the rotate tool s for scale tool g or a right click to pan through dc r for the ruler while this might actually seem like a pointless feature it's actually the best way to calculate distances in the editor to avoid doing that try and error stuff where you just do rinse and repeat next up we have shift s for smart snap which just helps you place nodes and align them properly ctrl g to show the grid shift d to enable grid snap and this just snaps everything to the grid if you have a numpad you can use the multiply key to increase the grid and the divide key to reduce the grid then we go over to our run section here and over here we have f5 to run the game ctrl shift f5 to quick run a scene so you can just easily pick any of the scenes you have in your project f6 to run the current scene and f8 to stop ctrl o to open the scene shift alt o to quick open as i said you can select through any scene you have in your project the difference between open scene and quick open scene is in open you have to go manually and open all the folders where your scenes are stored but quick open just gives you a rundown of all the scenes you have in your project then we have ctrl shift w to close the scene ctrl shift c to reopen the closed scene ctrl w to close the script ctrl shift s to save all the scenes ctrl shift f11 which is distraction free mode so you can focus on what you are doing at that particular point ctrl f12 to screenshot for some reason i don't know why they put that there and ctrl q to quit the editor that's all i got for now see you guys later